What's a crazy flight? It's mid-September, which means that if you're a rough grouse that was born in the spring, it's time to get out of Dodge. With a lot of species, at some point they have to engage in this behavior that's called natal dispersal, which basically means that they have to leave the territory of their parents and find new territory. There's a couple different reasons why this is an important strategy. One could be to kind of mix up the genetics so we don't have like all the animals of a single species in a single area are related and you get these inbreeding effects. Another reason is so that they don't overwhelm the habitat in any given area and like consume all the resources. But a lot of different species have these different ways that they disperse. So if you're a black bear cub, you're born while your mom is sleeping in the winter, you spend the first year with her, you hibernate with her the following winter, and then in June you get kicked out. And that's actually when we have a lot of trouble with these especially one and a half year old black bears that are forced out of their mom's territory and they have to move across the landscape to find their own territory. So a lot of different creatures engage in this behavior of natal dispersal in different ways. But the way that rough grouse do it is really unique. What they do is this thing called a crazy flight, which is where they just suddenly take off at high speeds and go looking for a new territory. This time of year, if you're in an area with a lot of rough grouse, you might see them zooming around, you might see them colliding with cars, colliding with houses. Now, sometimes they'll do it in multiple different jumps. So they'll take off, land somewhere, hang out there for a little bit, and then take off somewhere else. But my favorite version of this is that sometimes at this time of year, you'll flush a grouse and it'll go on this crazy flight and just zoom at high speeds through the forest and go and go and go and go and go. And then it'll land and look around and go, well, guess I live here now.